We're here to celebrate you. This is the best day of my life. I'm glad. First, yep, stop it. wrote some incredible stories that make us heroes look a lot more impressive than we actually are. We're also unveiling a new clean energy source called Terra. I'm told it's quite powerful stuff. And to explain how it works, the man who discovered it all, Dr. George Tarr. Uh, thank you, uh, Cap. <laughs> Captain Rogers. The Chimera is powered by a new mineral, Terrigen. Now, three years ago, I found a strange rock, yes, in the San Francisco Bay. Upon further tests, it was clear this mineral would be... I... Hello, San Francisco! The city of fine people, good food, and no parking. I am working on the no parking thing. Nice bag. The reactor won't stabilize! The Terrigen's molecular structure is breaking down it into a gas! Something below is feeding energy into the reactor! It's, it's extraordinary! Oh, take it down! Jarvis? You... Are you done? I have broken the encryption, so there is more to see. We have to shut down the reactor. It's pulling us towards that heat signature. Uh, I've tried, but there's no way to disengage the crystal. And get out. And seal the door. What? George, go. No. This can't be right. Head to the command deck. What? Evacuate now. No, 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 Cap. What are you doing? No, 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 no. Just stop. What are you doing? No. Cap smashed the reactor. After the government liquidation of Stark Industries, Dr. George Tarleton, himself a victim of A-Day and founder of Advanced Idea Mechanics, thinks science is the solution to our nation's problems. I wish I knew what happened to Captain Rogers that day, but I was nowhere near the reactor room. I don't have those answers, but I can promise you this. I will use this second chance to make you safe. AIM will find a cure for the inhuman disease. It can't be our man. He's still a liability. Oh, good. You're awake. I'm so sorry. Those synthoids were only following their security protocols. Stealing private information is a serious offense. Monica, give her a moment. Hey, what's going on? Where are you people taking me? Somewhere safe. Forgive me. <laughs> I know I don't quite compare to my holographic counterpart. But it's a nice trick for the shareholders. <laughs> Dr. Tarleton? In the flesh. Why did you hack our servers? I didn't steal anything. And what were you looking for? The cure, perhaps? Kamala, AIM only wants to free us from being at the mercy of the powerful. You know, subjectivity. Unlimited power, that's dangerous. It's lethal. A-Day was a prime example. You are lucky to be alive. But with technology, we can right their wrongs. We can give you back your normal life. A 
Look, I, I just guessed a password, okay? I, I didn't think I'd actually get in. She is clearly violent. Her infection must be getting worse. What? I, I didn't mean to hurt anyone. Of course not. But what happens when you lose control again? Hmm? What happens when you hurt someone that you love? Even the Avengers had to suffer for their hubris. Hey, were you there? I mean, when Cap died. Were you there? Yes. Luckily, Monica found me on the command deck. Her regenerative formula saved my life. Come on, Kamala. Let's do this. Yes? Let AIM help you. I'll take my chances. <laughs> Damn it, George! Get the girl, now! Subject 1102 can clone herself almost perfectly with the exception of a slight color variation in the eyes. The cells are splitting down the center, creating two separate individuals. Oh, it's, it's like the planarian flatworm, only human. Exactly. And can retain all the memories of the original subject. 0925 can create powerful bursts of energy, and, and there's at least a half a dozen with fire-based abilities. We're building an arsenal. Programmable power under our control. No more heroes. No more mistakes. It's time for another dose. I feel fine. You're in a coma for six months. Earlier, you could barely contain your cough. A few more doses of my regenerative formula, and your treatment will be complete. They still light candles at the base of that statue. If not for that hammer, I'd have torn the thing down. Leave it. Why have the public thinking you're still worried about the Avengers? Let my people handle it. We have a daptoid to launch. You're right. This version may be a bit more... potent. Is it stabilized? Almost. Incredible! You need to listen to logic and reason. Why start now? Wait! No! The stuff was in there! How are you feeling? I've never felt better. Your synthetics were useless. If you'd let me deal with the Hulk and Khan earlier, the Archive would still be standing. Watch your words. You no longer make the rules. He does. When I was young, I found an orphaned wolf cub in the forest behind our farm. What? Dad said it was too dangerous. He told me to get rid of it. I fed that cub. I named him. I watched him play with my beloved dog, Darwin. You're wasting my time. I felt if I could instill rules, the proper boundaries, I could harness the raw power of that beast. Have you done rambling? Almost. Oh. A few months later, while hunting, the adolescent cub turned on me, snarling, frothing at the mouth. Darwin bought me a few precious moments to call for help. My dad shot the wolf, but it was too late. Darwin had been torn to pieces. George. We need him. <laughs> I I'm sorry. I don't know what came over me. Leave. Please.
I'm giving you something better. The launch of the Adaptoids will be the perfect distraction. <clears throat> and after? Without proof that your cure works, words like terrorism are being bandied about in some of my circles. Oh, it will work, Senator. I have the utmost confidence in Dr. Rappuccini's abilities. How much of that was a lie? The effect of the gas is still only temporary. And without my formula to keep them alive, well, the gas... Kills them. This isn't working! That gas gave us the Adaptoid. My formula kept you alive. Now if I could isolate how it manifests within the Inhumans, I know I can reverse the effects. There are more opportunities here. We have enough powers harvested to build your army. It's time we cut our losses. Shut it down. How long have I been your lab rat? I knew you'd react like this. You'd rather die than need something from them. I trusted you. You saved your life. You can control machines with your mind. Just think of you all the- You infected me with his blood. It could have killed me. But it didn't. Remember the dream, George. How could you make me one of them? I made you strong. You stole my hope. And now, I am going to give you the same odds that I had. <laughs> of superpowers. Even if it has to end with me. Mistake, George. Don't call me that. George failed. Modoc won't. We can't cure this or what we've become. What are you saying? Power cannot be controlled. I know that now. It has to be destroyed. No. Our sacrifice will be remembered, Captain. <laughs> I'm guessing you all caught that. Let's take out that signal tower. And his face. I'm with her. As am I. Big guy. We can't get to the last transmitter in the Quinjet. Too much cover fire. What you thinking, Cap? The beacon must have been a decoy. Somehow Tarleton's still transmitting. You struggle against the unstoppable tide. Of this just got a whole lot weirder. What has happened to his face? You can slow me down, but I have enough mist to blanket the world. Avengers, no warships make it out of the quarantine zone. <laughs> Tony, take out those thrusters. Thought you'd never ask. Inhumanity is a blight on this earth. Oh, that hurt a little. I'll take it from here. 
everyone fan out. Buy me some time. He's down. Assemble on me. Matt, move in. Right behind you. Damn it. Options, people. Fine. On my way. As soon as you've got enough power, blast him. And his shield will fall. Understood. Century. Cap, I'm getting the feeling that gem in his forehead isn't just to look pretty. I think we've got bigger problems. Yeah, on it. You cannot win. Convince is yourself Ambigan.
happening.